Hi, my name is Matt Lee Bienvidal. I'm from Karnak Holistics. I'm here. This video is a series called Frequencies. <laughs> Hi, I'd like to just start with some housekeeping. Um, if you could like, share and subscribe so I can get this content out to obviously the mainstream in order to keep Karnak Elicits growing and to improve the content to help humanity. This video is titled Frequency, but focus upon the chakras and also the planet. Gaia, which is Earth. Gaia is the frequency of 7.83 Hertz the same as humanity. We coexist within the same energy, within the same hertz. So what happens to you, the universe or what happens to the earth and how it's affected happens to mankind. And this is for a reason because we coexist in some way we was made from dust, whatever your belief is to be. We, we, when we die, we go back to um, the earth plane. So the second thing I would like to speak about is about start with the, uh, the chakras. These chakras are seven points within our body. We start from the crown, right down to the roots, which is the base of your body. And these chakras mean certain things. I'll go into a bit more detail on another video of what these chakras are about. I think I've done a video already, but I'll, I'll re-update it about what chakras mean. So you can refer to this back to the chakra one, which I'll do in the future. So let's start with the crown chakra. Crown chakra is based here, okay? It's here, which is a powerful energy, which is linked to the universe and linked to the higher self and linked to God, the creator. This frequency is 6.3 six, yeah, six hertz. So those hertz are made up of the higher vibrations of humanity. This helps us with our connections with our higher self, our development, our spiritual development, our awareness of our own being. That's important because that's about your human development and how you work with those energies second thing is your third eye which is based here which is called a mind's eye and many people will have to see different things you see the, the little eye which is placed like this you might see on horus a lot of different faiths have have that so they're both all linked consistently all together that is 852 hertz that's focused upon your spiritual order when you're returning back to your spiritual order if you have moved away from your spiritual energy this energy or this hertz is what you can use um, in order to bring that energy back to you or for you to connect with those higher or those um, spiritual connections. Second thing is your throat, which is based here. This is based on communication. Communication, um, if you don't put out, you get sore throat. This is also used for healing. So if you're going to be, for example, a counsellor or a spokesperson, your throat is very strong. And that is 741 hertz. That's a very, very strong energy and it's only about, it's blue, but I'll go into that a bit more in detail on another video. It's important that we see and we understand what these are all about because with the communication, it helps us to know where we are and how we can balance ourselves. I'll go into a bit more how you can use these hurts and how we can help develop yourself and develop and heal yourself through these hurts. Second one, the next one is the heart, the heart track, which is here. Um, everyone knows what a heart is. Um, everyone's got a heart, so we're pleased to use it. It's really important. There's six, three, nine hertz. That is about love. And again, same thing as communication. It's about an emotional energy and using your emotions and being connected <clears throat> with different people on using that energy that's about here. And that's really, 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 really powerful. And a lot of the energy where you get spirit that appears will appear from the heart. The heart is one of the most, I'll go into the heart a bit more in depth when I talk about the chakras because the brain energy and the heart energy is, um, the, um, the heart is, has a stronger energy than the brain has, but I'll go into that a bit more in detail on another video. So the solar plexus is um, based just above your navel. That's where they say the spirit sits, which it does. Um, that's where your spirit appears and what you can use it for communication and spiritual connection. And that is six to eight hertz. That is about transformation and development and moving yourself forward, connecting with other spirits and other beings on this planet or another planet as well. And having it all connected makes it really powerful. That's about transformation. So if you're doing a lot of spiritual work, you use your solar plexus to develop yourself moving forward. The sacral chakra, which is your navel, that's very, very important. Um, that is 
um, 417 hertz and that's all about um, undergoing change and transformation and also it's about your sexual energy so that's basically where your um, uh, genitals are and um, don't get excited now stay <laughs> to behave yourself so basically is about your the genital part is about sexual um, progression and if you have a connection, if it's sexual energy that comes from there, it's another powerful energy that helps you with your development as well. Next one is a root, which is at your base of your feet. Um, that can that when you hear some people say ground yourself, that's what it's talking about. Is that energy is your root chakra? That is six three two hertz. That's sometimes based around guilt and about fear. So when when I work with people, I say ground yourself because that helps you get back to Mother Earth and connects you with um Gaia which is also so powerful and it helps you to develop and move forward so basically when I speak about these different chakras so basically let me just quickly go through those again so you can remember because I know I was speaking about various bits and pieces so let me just quickly run through each chakra so you've got the crown chakra which is six and nine six three hertz and you've got the eye um, which is the third eye which is here that is eight five two hertz and then you've got the throat chakra which is based here that is 741 hertz, really powerful, um, use that as I mentioned before. You've got the heart chakra, which is 639 hertz. And then you've got the solar plexus, which is 528 hertz. Um, and then you've also got the, I think I said the solar plexus. And then you've got the sacral chakra, which is 417 hertz. And you've got the root chakra, which is 932 hertz. So how do you use them and why would you use them? Simple as when if you want to use them, it's what we are created of. Your chakras or um affect your aura, which is all around you. When you have these hertz in your on YouTube, for example, you get uh, biennial biennial beats, which will play different um, wave sounds, and those different frequencies affect your different chakras. So you can Google, for example, or put into YouTube a certain um, frequency or a certain say chakra, or you want to talk about solar plexus, you can put in um balancing if you can't sleep at night for example you want to develop yourself um your immune system that's really good for using those um videos and those sound waves you can create your own sound waves that i've done in the past in order to help with development and meditation um very powerful and very important so what i'll come back to on my next video is talk about chakras um and more in-depth one-to-one and go through each video each one based on each chakra but for this one, I just wanted to start off introducing you to my new series called Frequency and make helping you understand your spiritual connection with Gaia and the amazing universe created by the creator. Stay blessed, stay safe and keep shining.